Teachers from across the Tennessee Valley Authority's seven state region have applied for a $5,000 STEM grant, three selected out of Limestone County. Now that money is for the classroom projects that expose students to science, technology, engineering, and math. News 19's Lindsey Smith spoke with the three recipients about what they plan to do with that grant money. For three teachers in the Athens City School System, applying for this grant was a no brainer. They say they're excited to have been selected and ready to equip their classroom with the tools they need. These kids, they can do so much. People underestimate elementary kids so often, and I, I have the best job ever. I see pre K through third grade in the STEM lab, and they can do so much. Lab specialist Diane Trout at Hart Academy says she plans to use the funding to add two new 3D printers along with flex beds and filament. So when the students design something in Tinkercad, they design it in the workspace and whenever they're ready, they let me know. And then I download it to the computer and then we, I pull it into the workspace right here and I can resize it. And then basically what happens is the computer sends it to the 3D printer that melts the filament down and then prints it out in whatever shape that the students have created. At Spark Academy, STEM specialist Jennifer Kennedy tells me she plans to add two new hydroponic towers in the lab and expand their indoor garden and refresh their outdoor growing spaces with soil and benches. We're going to grow different types of lettuces. We're going to have tomatoes so at the end of the year all the third grade can have this beautiful, delicious celebratory salad that they grew in our hydroponics garden. I want my students to have the latest technologies available to them in the classroom. And over at Athens Renaissance School, STEAM Studios coordinator Taylor Wisenant says they plan to use the funds to enhance their outdoor classroom and garden. The students are getting to learn research skills, presentation skills, coding skills, uh, in addition to all this work with the gardening. We've been working on it for at least a couple months and uh, on the weekends we've been having grown um, parents come out and help us build all of this. Learning about like rocks and minerals. We're learning about like fossils. Kind of like what rocks might be harmful to the plants, like if there's any like dirt clumps or dirt clumps with rocks in them like or that are next to the roots, they might like be very sharp and like cut the roots and stop the circulation of the plant to where they could stop growing. Reporting in Athens, Lindsay Smith, News 19. Since 2018, TVA has provided almost 5 million in STEM grants for almost 600,000 students across its footprint. We have a link to view the full list of grant recipients as well as more information on how you can apply for future STEM grants on WHNT.com.